I'm Senator Double Corey. I represent the North End of Hartford, West End of Hartford, Bloomfield, and Windsor. Um, I'm here with my colleague, Representative Bobby Gibson, representing Bloomfield. We are here proudly to inform the public of a great event that's going to take place this weekend. We're celebrating the life and legacy of Walter Doc Hurley, one of the great men of the community. He was a member of Omega Size 5 fraternity. He established a scholarship from so a member of people can go to college for free. Um, we want to celebrate the fact that we're going to honor him with a statue on Saturday. Um, we want to appreciate all the things that he has provided, all the opportunities he has given to people in our community. Um, his daughter, who also was an educator, we thank her and we thank his family for giving him um, to us for these years. He was a great man, great role model, great mentor, great friend, and one of the best ways you can do is honor a person with a statue. And lastly, Walter Doc Hurley was a common man. He was an everyday man. Most of the times you see people who are recognized as statues are people you hear in history books. Well, this man grew up in Hartford, walked the same streets of Hartford, and did everything he can do to help provide a quality education beyond high school for those who lived in our community. He was respected by everyone and loved by everyone, and I'm honored to be able to secure the funds to build a statue in his honor. Yes, I would just like to um, back up the words from my colleague here, my fraternity brother, Senator Doug McCroy. Um, Doc Curley was an outstanding man. We probably would not be here today without having role models like Doc Curley. I'm going to ask you to please come out and support the events. On Friday, there's going to be a VIP reception with the president of Virginia State University, which was Doc Curley's um, alma mater. So please come out and support that. It's going to be at the Marriott Hotel. On Saturday, as my colleague has said, please come out to the statue unveiling. It's going to be an outstanding day. Great weather, a parade before that to the statue unveiling. And then later that afternoon, our fraternity, Omega Psi Five Fraternity Incorporated, Toyota Chapter, we're going to have a community day at the Artist Collective where there's going to be free food and games and face painting. And then finally, it's going to culminate on Sunday at Metropolitan Church where he was a member. And we're going to have a great church service. So please come out and support. Again, he was our fraternity brother, always will be a great man in this community. And we're asking you to please come out. I'm going to pass this off now to State Rep. Um, Josh Hall, but before you, I talked about what the great things that Doc heard in regards to higher education, one of the things that he's most noted about is providing opportunity scholarships for young people to go to college. And one of the recipients of the Doc Hurley Scholarship is Joshua Wall, state representative from the 7th District. And he has some things to say about Walter Doc Hurley, too. Yes. Uh, so uh, as, as uh, Senator McCrory indicated, I'm not here. Uh, without the help and support of Doc Hurley and the Doc Hurley Foundation. Uh, he provided the necessary resources for me to go off uh, to Norfolk State University, behold the green and gold, and come back and serve my community in this capacity. So I want to thank Doc Hurley and his family for all that they've given to the uh, community in the city of Hartford, and especially as one of my uh, constituents and as uh, uh, Senator McCoy's constituents. Uh, we thank him a lot for all this effort, and this is an overdue honor for one of the greatest uh, uh, citizens and residents of the state of Connecticut, especially the community of Hartford. So thank you to Doc.